What up? Welcome back to Broken Age with Backwards That Guy here. And we are continuing on with Vela. And we are going to have to join this uh, feast. And see if we can take out Mog Chothra. As we saw last time. So let's see, uh, let's get back into it and see what's going on. Let's see what's going on with these ladies. Hi. You maidens getting ready for the maidens feast? I want to be in the maidens feast. Of course you do, poor thing. But shell maidens are chosen only after a long period of qualifying events. Also, our dads are pretty powerful. Also, can I tell you something? Just as a friend. Oh my god, yes, just as a friend. You just don't smell right, girl. Oh, I'd want a friend to tell <laughs> me that. So, I'd want a friend to tell me that. They're so obsessed with smell. Well, here's like a perfume thing. Can I just use that? Oh yeah, here we go. Hey, can I have some of that perfume? <laughs> That's not perfume. That's a proprietary luring compound known as Beast Hooker. It's irresistible to Mogs. <laughs> okay, Beast Hooker. Interesting. Hey, can I have some of your beast hooker? That's better. But no, you can't. <laughs> Sorry. It's her secret sauce. Secret sauce? Okay. Creepy. How about just one little squirt? Sorry. If I'm not going to give any to my best friend, Drusilla, I'm certainly not going to give any to you. I said I don't want any. I don't use performance enhancers. Performance enhancers? Nice. Yeah, don't you ever wonder if there's another way? Don't you guys ever wonder if there's another way? To save the town, I mean. Um, this is how it's always been done. Yeah, they figured out how to do it a long time ago, so we wouldn't have to think about it. <laughs> so we don't have to think about it. Yeah, uh, it's interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna kill him. Hey, maidens, I'm going to kill Mog Chathra. Not half as hard as I'm gonna kill it. I'm already killing <laughs> it in this outfit, just standing here. Wow. Nice costume. Nice costumes. Thanks. Our dads made them. They're the best fishermen in the village, so they're pretty good at tying lures. We had to use every hook in town, but it was worth it. Use every hook in town. Okay, so I'm probably gonna need one of those. Yeah, hasn't pe aren't people gonna miss them? Isn't somebody gonna miss those hooks? Not as much as they're gonna miss us. You're gonna make me cry, girl. <laughs> so weird. You maidens nervous? Yeah, nervous that Marshall Dune isn't gonna get the offering arena ready before Mog Chothra gets here. Oh, I can't believe our dads donated so much to his campaign. See you maidens later. Ciao! So... It's just so creepy how like excited they are to get eaten by a monster. <laughs> What's up here? Oh, what is this? Who are these people? A sighted stranger approaches. Not yeah. so fast. Darn. All <laughs> out of holy tear gas. Use the staff. Oh yeah. Halt. But the dead eye god sees no one. Sound like little kids. Who are you two? I am Dead Eye Dawn, and this is Dead Eye Courtney. Hi. Dead Eye Dawn and Dead Eye Courtney. Interesting. What is this place? The Dead Eye Pyramid, Tomb of the Dead Eye God. <laughs> As if you didn't know. <laughs> yeah, let me go inside. Can I go inside? You wish to invade our holiest of shrines? Why? So guys are guarding it, so it must be cool. Because you guys are guarding it, so it must be cool. Oh, it is. Extremely cool. But no one enters the Dead Eye Pyramid. No one. Well... Unless... What? Well... 
If she could solve the riddle of Yorn... Oh, yeah. If she could solve that, then she'd definitely be worthy. The riddle of Yorn? No problem. Give it to me. Um, could you remind me how the riddle of Yorn goes one more time? You always take us down when we are in our prime. Devour your sweet rewards, yet I'll return in time. A child of mine will rise out of his rotten bed, up from a hidden pit long after I am dead. Well. Yeah. Bring us a solution, and you may enter the pyramid. Interesting. Who's the dead eye god? The Messiah from the sky. Bringer of miracle objects. Someday he will rise to return our sight and begin the Battle of Volgantol. Okay. Did your god bring any miracle objects that were like weapons? The kind that could take down a giant monster before it destroyed your home village? Our god had such power and more. Probably. I mean, really. <laughs> Probably. We don't even know what half the stuff in there does. Oh, I need to get in there. I lost your sight? Did you say you lost your sight? Yes, that happens when you blind yourself. Oh. If the dead eye god has no need for sight, then neither do we. Huh. What? It's creepy. So they just blinded themselves? Hey, can I get you guys something? Like what? Refreshing bath and some more. Oh, yeah. Some more holy tear gas? Oh, yeah. Here. Just fill that up for me if you could. Thanks. Sweet. Okay. Well, let's see what this is real What's quick. What's the Battle of Volgantol? The final battle between humans and mobs. The end of our entire age. Hmm. Sounds promising. Nice. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Sense you later. Sense you later. It's all out of holy tear gas. Holy tear gas. So what is holy tear gas? Maybe that perfume stuff? Hmm. So what else can we do? What else do I have? I have These fishing poles are useless. All the hooks have been stolen. So I need to maybe get the hooks from them? Can I give them a stool? That's not a good use for a stool. That's not a good use for a stool. I wonder if maybe they want a stool? No. So I... Let's cut this ribbon already. You tell them, non-maiden. The ribbon is there for your protection. The arena is still under construction. We have one like that back home for making upside down cakes. Interesting. I don't know what that's for. Okay, so what am I supposed to do here? Huh, we need to get this construction done. Right? So. These fishing poles are useless. All the hooks uh, have been stolen. Come this way. Let's go talk to these guys again real quick. Shh! Here she comes again! Can I... Oh. Alright, let's hear this one more time. And think about it. Um, could you remind me how the riddle of Yorn goes one more time? You always take us down. When we are in our prime, devour your sweet rewards, yet I'll return in time. A child of mine will rise out of his rotten bed, up from a hidden pit 
long after I am dead. Wow. Yeah. Bring us a solution, and you may enter the pyramid. Interesting. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Sense you later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys want a stool? This stool is the solution to your riddle. How's that? Well, I mean, you could sit on it while you think of the real answer. Yeah, <laughs> that's not what I meant. I just want to give them something to sit on. What's this? You want this? This pretty window is the solution to the riddle? Are you asking me or telling me? Telling you? <laughs> this? Think about this. You can take down a ladder. Go on. And it can rise again and get you out of a pit. But what about the rotten bed? Well, just ignore that part. You can't ignore it. <laughs> just ignore that part. <laughs> Alright. I'll bet I can make a million off of this idea. So. Come on, Clarence, we're running out of time. Can I give this to these girls? You guys want to see something pretty? That's okay. I already have a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Her mirror is really pretty. Ah, that's dumb. Okay. Can I, like... I can't fill the holy tear gas dispenser with that. Oh, why not? What about this thing? Come to me, old chum. I mean, oh, yeah. when is this not going to come in handy? Yeah, yeah that sounds lovely. Can I use it on myself? No way. I'm not becoming seagull bait. Really? You need to... They keep telling you you need to smell better. Alright, let's go, let's go up here. i give this to them. Maybe they'll help me out? Shh! Here she comes again! I've got the riddle solution. Fish guts! Hmm. I suppose they could be fish in their prime. And the ocean could be a pit. But it's not hidden. And baby fish don't rise out of it. That would be super creepy. Good effort there, though. So, no, I was bringing this back. Huh. So, what am I supposed to do with the fish guts? Can I squirt these guys? <laughs> uh, gross, Drusilla! Don't you think I can smell that? Okay, this time it really wasn't me. This time it really wasn't me? Is this about the feathers we took for our costumes? You can have them back! <laughs> hey, maybe this perfume is what's attracting them. I'll get rid of it. Great! Ow! Great idea! What about me? Ow! I exude it naturally! She has to save whom she can't. Ow! I'll tell Mog Chopra about you, Drusilla. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> the things monsters go for these days. So, is this possibly also. Here she comes again. Solution? The solution to the riddle of Yorn is perfume. Because you put it in your rotten pits. What about the part with the children? Oh, yeah. You don't really put. <laughs> Alright. I bet I could make a million off of this idea. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, we still have the stool. Now we have the perfume. Marshall Dune? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, the bucket hat. Hey, do you know the answer to the riddle about the pits and rotten bed? What kind of pits are you talking about? Hmm. Huh. Not sure. Interesting. Hey, 
About your bucket hat. What? What about it? It looks great on you. Very fancy. What? Fancy? But I'm a man of the people. I'm never going to win this election if I come off as haughty and elite. Here, take this away from me. Ha! Thank you, child. I'm firing my stylist tomorrow. Yes, I got the bucket. I need to enter the Maiden's Feast. Child, at this point, we may not even have a Maiden's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How about now? Is the construction coming along better? Ah, the sand is falling apart, and so am I. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. These maidens aren't going to serve up themselves. <laughs> okay. So now we got the bucket. You guys need a bucket? Nah, we just go in our costumes. Because when are we ever going to wear them again? <gasps> Drusilla, quiet! We have an image to maintain. <laughs> yeah, you're covered in poop. Can I use this here? As much as I would like some chum, I don't think it's smart to carry it around in an open container with those gulls around. Talk to these guys again. These ladies. We made it. Yeah. After you took that beast hooker away, they eventually left us alone. Thank you so much, non maiden. Yeah, you're welcome. Now give me, give me those hooks. I want to be in the maiden's beast. Well, maybe we could put in a good word for you since you helped us with that bird attack. Yeah, our dads are pretty powerful. Yeah, he said that. All right, what do they gotta say about the riddle? Hey, are you guys good with riddles? Of course we are. Except the kind where there are words that have like two meanings. Oh yeah, and you think the word means one thing, but it actually means the other thing? Yeah, I hate those. <laughs> it's not like that, is it? Uh, maybe. <laughs> okay. See you, maidens, later. Yep. See ya. Okay, so. Pit. Let's go. Maybe the bucket has something to do with the riddle? Shh! Here she comes again! I think this bucket is the solution to the riddle of Yorn. Why? Because buckets are the solution to everything. Not this time! <laughs> okay, that was really dumb. Alright, where? How? Let's get out of here. Okay, so. A bucket. What do I do with a bucket? Oh, that's right, the sap. Hmm, it's already soaking into the ground. I have to catch it when it's fresh. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. Don't mess with it. Hey, can I have some of your sap? You're just like the rest of them. I'll let you get back to your screen. And now you're decorating me like a Christmas tree? Is there no end to the humiliation? Okay, so then we piss him off and he throws up again. Oh, I have to show him the stool, that's right. You can still see the grain of the wood. <laughs> Aha! So we got the sap. Wow, the sap is super thick. Super thick sap. What do I use it for? Can I use it on the snake? No, that doesn't need to be any thicker or stickier. Hmm. Okay, 
Okay, so we've got the sap. Watch out for the crosswind. Can you what do we need there? to use it on? Huh. Again. Hey, you take sap down from a tree, right? And? And? Well, that's it. <laughs> that's it. No, no, not like that. I don't know what we use this for. On them? That would be fun, but making them sticky won't solve much. Okay. So you need some sap? First, con construction. Here, this will make your sand mixture stick together better. Aha! Uh -huh. Really? How do you know? I'm a baker. I know my ingredients. At this point, I'd try anything. Hey, Clarence, bring that load down here, will you? Aha! Uh -huh. I hope you're right about this. It's never failed me before. How many times have you used it? Never. Shh. Let's watch. I am. Here comes a wave. I can't look. What I tell you? Now that's a nice. sand castle. Looks like we're in business. All right. All we need to do now is get those maidens in tune. The maidens in tune? Time for the talent portion. Let's practice. Oh, Mog, shine your light on me. Okay. Oh, Mog, shine your light. Oh boy, that is Sup, awful. Maidens? Oh, just waiting around to save the town. See you, maidens. All right, so we need to solve. That's the note, okay? Let's do it again. Yeesh. That is awful. Marshall Dune? Mm hmm? I need to enter the Maiden's Feast. Well, I suppose I do owe you one for your help with construction. Yeah. Unfortunately, you just don't have the right scent for it, my child. What are you talking about? Better let you get back to the feast. Oh man, <coughs> the things monsters go for these days. All right, now let's talk to him. Marshal Dune? Mm -hmm. I need to enter the Maiden's Feast. That's the note, okay? Let's do it again. Almost ready. Hurry up, girl. When the beast arrives, it's showtime. I have to get some sort of powerful weapon before Mog Chathra gets here. Okay. Better let you get back to the feast. So I accidentally yes. skipped that, but he apparently told us, dang it, that we can go to the feast, so we're Let's good. Now this ribbon already. we need to find the answer to the riddle. Huh. But uh, we're going to have to leave that for next time. And maybe, uh, what's his name? Curtis over here. Has a, has something I can use. I don't know. Hmm, this guy hasn't gotten mail in a while. Yeah, so, uh, we're gonna wrap it up right here for today. And, uh, we will come back in the next episode and uh, figure out the riddle and uh, take on Mog Chothra. So stay tuned in for that and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.